Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Introt Gaming. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you and I hope you've had a great day. Before we get started, just a quick reminder to please like this video, leave a comment below, and subscribe if you want to see more. But in the meantime, I hope you enjoy this episode of Undertale. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. I don't like you, Flowey. This is the place. Gotta watch out for Asgore. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. They're always watching. It's a tough looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. Oh, didn't like that sound. Oh, what was that? so scary who are you help human don't you know how to greet a new pal turn around and shake my hand Wilson? Oh. It's a bone man. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. What is this font? Anyway, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. Oh, he's, he's, he's a funny man. He's Comic Sans, isn't he? Oh, come on. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Okay, so we got Sans and Papyrus. <sighs> oh. Now I wish I would have named myself Ariel. I'm actually starting to get it now. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> Sup, bro? <laughs> nice. You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the Great Papyrus, will get all things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Mm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is just sit and bomb doggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> yeah, Sans. Come on, you're smiling. 
I am and I hate it. <sighs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. <laughs> Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Heh 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 Oh, these guys. Okay, you can come out now. Yeah, I wish I would have named myself, like, Calibri or something like that. Now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. All right. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. That's... That's... That's behind. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Yay! I'm filled with determination. Use the box? Yeah, use it. Oh, I see. Let's grab that. Oh. What are you, Snowdrake? You're pretty cool looking, dude. Whoa, better not snowflake out. Oh. Snowdrake is smiling at its own bad joke. Got him. 22 XP, 18 gold. Your love increased. Nice. All right. Um, right. Let's go to the right. <laughs> so, as I was saying about Undyne. Uh oh. <laughs> They're dancing. Sans! OMG, is that a human? He's so happy. Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Uh oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? OMG? Is, is that a human? Yes. <laughs> Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will- I'm gonna- I'll be so- Popular! Popular, popular! <clears throat> human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sans. Well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. You just let me write to him. Oh, cool. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. Yeah, reel it in. All that's attached is a photo of the weird looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decide not to call. Do we still have our cell phone? You send the line back out. All right. We can check that later. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. All right. Hey, who's there? Ice Cap. Ice Cap straight ahead. Let's see, can we talk to them? Oh, can I steal them? You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. Oh man. 
Dang it. Whoa! Alright. I want his hat. That's loose. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Go back, go back. Um, let's steal his hat now. You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat and succeeded. It melts in your hands. Oh, bummer. So cold. Ice Cap is no more. It smells like frozen despair. Got it. 40 gold. Sweet. Absolutely no moving. Okay. Hey, who are you? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Pupper. Doggo blocks the way. He's got two swords. One of them is behind his back. Okay. Good boy. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Aw, oh, come on, puppy. Whoa! So I don't move? Doggo is confirming the moving object. Huh. Oh. Can I do it? Try it again? It moved. It didn't not move. There we go. Can I try it again? Good boy. Yay! What? I've been pet! Hot pet pat! <laughs> Good boy. Where's that coming from? Doggo has been pet. Do we keep doing it? I don't want to fight the doggy. There's no end to it. Maybe he just doesn't like being pet. Got 30 gold. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Hello? Is anybody there? No. I wanted to read the sign. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Hmm. I wonder who that could be. Sans, my man. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. <laughs> You're not helping. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Ugh. Whoa! North ice, south ice, west ice, east Snowden Town, and ice. Snowman! Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you, good luck. You got the snowman piece. Stay chill, my man. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh no, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. Or you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. 
When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. So I just can't touch the wall? <laughs> Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Okay. Incredibly slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your brother's an idiot. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Ew, gross. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? <laughs> Tree. Man. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Yeah. Have a super duper day. You've got the nice cream. Whoa. Oh, where does that go? It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. I wonder if I have to do that snow thing. I mean, I want to. There's a camera hidden inside this lump of snow. Why does it melt so fast? Is that my fault? Sands, what's happening? I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Yeah. I meant 50 gold. Nope, you're right. That's still too low. Hang on. Let me go back down here. It's probably just the same thing. Aw. Human, I hope you're ready. Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Word search? Hey kids, can you come help me solve this puzzle? I mean, this isn't really a word search, right? What am I supposed to do? Sans, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that's easy peasy word scramble. That's for baby bones. Oh, the leave the bowl. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Hmm. Crossword? You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. 
It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sands. Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Papyrus. Oh, read it again. Okay. I can't actually do that. Uh, now I kind of want to go back up top just to see. Yay, dinner. Oh, uh hello. -huh. There we go. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat the spaghetti up fills you with determination. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know the spaghetti is a trap. Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize you aren't progressing. Thoroughly joked again by the great Papyrus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. An unplugged microwave. All the sitting say spaghetti. Come out, widow mouse. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman, white rating, can become yellow rating. Uh-oh. Unsuspicious smell, puppy blue rating, smell of rolling around. Weird smell, humans, gr <laughs> green rating, destroy at all costs. What? Okay. Not sure what I read there. Found that very confusing. Warning, dog marriage. <laughs> uh oh. Ooh, lesser dog. Oh, pet, 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 pet. You barely left your hand and you got excited. <laughs> Who's a good boy? You lightly touch the dog, it's already overexcited. Oh, lesser dog is barking excitedly. Alright. You pet the dog, it raises its head up to meet your hand. He's so happy. He's a happy boy. Alright. You pet the dog. It was a good dog. Ah, got me. He's definitely overstimulated. That's excitement knows no bounds. Right. Critical pet. Excitement level increased. Lesser dog is overstimulated. <laughs> What's happening to his head? You have to jump up to pet the dog. <laughs> you don't even pet it. It gets more excited. Plane take off. Uh-oh. There's no way to stop this madness. He shows no signs of stopping. He enters the realm of the clouds. You call the dog, but it's too late. It cannot hear you. <laughs> uh, come back, pupper. Oh, his head's coming back down? What is happening to this little guy? You, you can reach Lesser Dog again. You 
Coming back down. Good boy. He's coming back down. What's happening to this little dog? It's possible that you may have a problem. let the boy go. Okay. That's where I am. He's telling me that the key's up here. Somewhere. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Yes. Nice. Nothing there. Oh. Hello? What's that smell? Where is that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Don't move a muscle. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Aww. Not a double dog. <laughs> Take my wife's please don't actually. Whoa. Whoa. Two nozzle champs. Of course, we were second. Okay. The dogs are reevaluating your smell. Let's get rid of this guy. I'll chop you in half. Oof. Oof. She's not happy with me. See what I have. Water donut. Hey, got me a little bit better. Kneel and suffer. Oh. That's a tough one. I think I'm crashed. Let's see. There we go. Get her? Yay! Nice. Lots of XP. 50 gold. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. What? Hey! You! How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Ate it, left it. I ate it. Really? Wowee. No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> Ugh.
Eh? Hi, pal. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Human. Hmm? How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is... Worry not, human. I, the Great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. Interesting. Okay. Push the switch, would you? Okay, let's reset it. Let's go this way. How's that? Wow, you solved it, and you did it all without my help. Incredible. I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Hey, it's a human. You're going to love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alf Alphys. You should see these tiles. Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? I, I want to say no, but I think he's just going to say it all again. Okay, I guess I'll repeat myself. <laughs> I knew he was going to do that. Wait, he said it different this time. <laughs> Brown Wait, there are no right. He's all messed up now. 
purple tap smell like lemons. Why don't the yellow ones smell lemony? Um, wait. Did I mix up green and blue? The blue ones are water ones. Tiles? I don't, I don't remember. Wait. Those ones don't do anything. Okay. Do you understand better now? Even less. Okay, you know what? How about you just do this puzzle on your own? I'll leave the instructions, just read them. Then when you understand it, you can throw the switch and do it at your own pace. Good luck. Oh, he left the instructions for me. It's a legible chicken scratch. Yeah, I'm not doing that puzzle. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier? It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Papyrus, they beat your puzzle. Pig. Oh. Wait, what? Broken head of a snow dog? That's not a dog. That's a snow dog. Knowing that dog would never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. If you enjoyed the video, please like the video. If you want to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe. And be sure to turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.